So here I am, worth it. But I have a different filament, which I got from this like called Giz Gizmo Dorks, something like that. Uh, this is coming from what's this one? 3D Inline. I had got bad reviews on this one, but this one works pretty good uh, for letters and making the lift the flame boxes. And so far, I've been working with this Gizmo Dorks, and all I've been getting is fail after fail. Almost done. So, what I'm thinking is that, so for the first two that I did, um, let's see. So, for the first two I did, turn that light on. For the first two I did, this was a 20% infill because I'm just trying to preserve on uh, <laughs> uh, PLA, you know. Uh, this was 20%. Then once I, that one's a mess up. This one, I kind of caught on to it when that messed up. Then this one I did 100%. 100% everything finished out but the V. So that's the issue right there. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to make the letters thicker. So as you see, so now, all right, so here I am on Tinkercad. And what I'm doing is I have to, like I said, I'm going to make the letters thicker. Uh, let's see. Let me go get that box. All right, so it's uh, it's my dorks. That's what I'm doing it by. That's why I got the filling it from. I actually got the wrong kind. This is more of a, a translucent. Um, like I said, I already did like two or three prints and they didn't come out good. So now I'm gonna do a final print. I'm gonna make the letters thicker because the only letter really that's messing up is the uh, the V. And I already saved my height. Our way. That's one important thing with 3D print. If you got like that perfect measurement, save save those numbers. Save those numbers because uh, they will help. So. Save them in. So now I'm gonna be moving them and doing what I got planned here. So yes, yeah, so I can get that right. And that was hmm, that don't look right. It says 195. No, that ain't right. I think it was 95. That don't have to look right. It don't look like this one back here. Hold on. Am I looking at the right one? Here, we're going to find it in just a second. Jesus. Oh, 115. I wonder if I did it. What's this one? Hold on. That's 195. Uh, I don't remember. <laughs> All right, so I guess I have to just free ball it until I get something I like. I'm going to try to get that same one. Let's see. Oh, man, I love my laptop too, man. Love to put it right there. So we're going to make it a tad bit longer. Bam. Right there, 42. I got that. No, I don't. So I don't know how I made that mistake. But, yeah.
like so this is where I'm at so all right I got some of it built I have the lights in but the only issue is the position of the light now the light can't sit like this you barely see it no way no different so I need the light to kind of be distance off you gotta be like probably like that far off so it doesn't have the little ring let me see if you can see it see that little circle I'm trying to avoid that so I gotta back it off enough where it just feels it right there so I gotta get the measurements of this I just got my little handy tool here don't know how to measure a circle, but I'm gonna try the best I can. Oh man, I think my thing on there. Hold on. Hold on. Oh man, I think it's on there. Jesus, when I finally need it, it ain't working. But there are numbers on here, so we're gonna work off that. So, in a way, so we need circle to be at least 30 millimeters. Well, I guess from end to end, 30 millimeters. Uh, and we need that consistent all the way around it. Yeah. So 30 millimeters around. Then I gotta come up with the light holder. See the bulb needs to be like right here. That's where the bulb needs to be. Like right there. So right this is it. That's where it needs to be. So I gotta pick out the measurements of this. Then I'm gonna try to make that on Tinkercad. I have no idea how to do none of this. But
messing around. Uh, the reason I want to get this red, it looks like crap right now, but this red look is really good. So I'm gonna spend some time on Tinkercad and work it like work it out like that. So let me get to work. I don't know how long it's gonna be, but but my ultimate goal. Hold on. But my ultimate goal is, see, love is, I know Valentine is coming, but my ultimate goal is to get, like, names. Uh, my name, Corey, Tanya, uh, Shantae, like, different names. Uh, but somewhere in the middle, you might get, like, a square uh, with the light behind it. Um so it's, it's going to be fully customized uh, how to do it. Hey, this thing came out. This stuff is brutal. Mm, should I break it? Okay. So this stuff can break real good. And that was at 100% infill. That's why the V doesn't last. See, the V is already coming off. So look at that. Came off real easy. So that's what I'm gonna build. I'm gonna build it just right this time though. So but it looks real good. I like that red on there. See it right there. Got that nice shimmer. Y'all looking at the rugged part. The ultimate goal is to get it just like this. Like that. With the light behind it. See in dark it looks real good. You can see it real good. So and then if you want to hold it in the window. Mm. Oh, that's how we're going to do it. <laughs> Gotta get the word.
Alright, so we have come to a point of the video where I like best. But this is where I originally got everything, get like the whole idea. I got my uh, Beagle print camera. And I'm still still feeling my way around that. And this white filament, this what this is my day one right here. Um I did change the brand once, but I like this one. I like the feel how tough it is. Yeah. And I want to do the love and the heart separate. And then I wanted to do the love and the heart together. So this piece right here is separate. And I'm trying it out. And after I had built it, that's when I decided. I said, hold on, you know what? Let me see if I can do the letters in a different color. But the lifto fan will have to be uh, white. White or gray. I'm looking. I'm going to be looking. I'm going to try gray. So that's me. I did all the hard work. I think I did it all with me. I got off work about four or five, and then I was doing this to about like eleven. But over time, it took about a week because the fail prints and that, this and that, this and that. So, and I like the results that came about, and I decided to do my daughter, which y'all can see, and my little girl.